People of African descent have been part of shaping Canada's heritage and identity since the early 1600s. Few Canadians are aware of the fact that African people were once enslaved in the territory that is now Canada, or of how those who fought enslavement helped to lay the foundation of Canada's diverse and inclusive society. Black History Month is a time to learn more about these Canadian stories and the many other important contributions of Black Canadians to the settlement, growth, and development of Canada, and about the diversity of Black communities in Canada and their importance to the history of this country. In December 1995, the House of Commons officially recognized February as Black History Month in Canada, following a motion introduced by the first Black Canadian woman elected to Parliament, the Honourable Jean Augustin, bringing us where we are today. It allows me to step into the minds of those who faced oppression, as well as the brave African Canadians who took risks to open opportunities. It's very important to me because it showcased the world who we are as a people. So uh, we've contributed through music, we've contributed science, we've contributed in so many different ways, and um, it showcases who we are as a people. So Miles, Miles, Miles Davis, um, Winter Marsalis, John Coltrane, these are some of the musicians I really enjoy listening to. But more than that, we're so much more than music. We've contributed a lot to the world. And it's great for one month for the people to see who we are as a people. Black History Month is important to me because it celebrates the people who came before us and changed the way black people are looked at. To me, it's very important because it is a time when, as Blacks, we can celebrate all the accomplishments and achievements of Blacks in Canada and in the world. There's a lot that we don't know that is not taught in schools that needs to be taught. If anyone has inspired me to speak out about racial challenges, that would have to be my parents, specifically my mother. As being both a single mother, being black and a woman work in a workplace, she has a lot of things going against her for her. My parents have inspired me to become more inclusive within a community so we can work through challenges that we face to become a better community altogether. A modern representation of someone who inspired me is Shonda Rhimes, as she's opened many opportunities for the minority to be casted as main roles within the film industry. My parents, seeing how they struggle to overcome racial challenges and still accomplish the Canadian dream. Historically speaking, uh, I'm inspired by Viola Desmond, uh, Lincoln Alexander, um, and moving forward in today's world, I look at students and our youth as an inspiration as they speak out against social injustice throughout the world and being a voice and advocates. It inspires me to take a stand and assist them in any which way that I can. Someone who's inspired me would be Colin Kaepernick because he put his own career on the line just to speak out against racial injustice. And I think this is something that's really important to look at as, as a role model for black youth. I think the main thing that we can do is that we can show respect for each other's culture and also compassion. Everybody has things that are different in their culture and we need to appreciate it. We can take a moment to remember that we're all equal in God's eyes and therefore everyone should be equal to each other. If there's anything we can do to eliminate racial or cultural problems in our world, it's, it's really just to respect and love each other as God would love anyone else. I think it's important that we listen to one another and we educate ourselves on other cultures and traditions. That way we are more likely to live in harmony and accept one another for our differences. I also believe as a Catholic educator, it's imperative that we model Jesus Christ in our active living. Jesus was accepting of all and he recognized everybody as children of God. During Black History Month, let us celebrate the many achievements and contributions of Black Canadians who throughout history have done so much to make Canada a culturally diverse, compassionate and prosperous nation it is today.